Hello and welcome to the first annual GH Games. It looks like we have a great turnout for today. Yes, indeed. You can almost smell the excitement in the air. I'm pretty sure that's sweat, Warren. <laughs> well, you might be right about that one, John. <laughs> Anyways, my name is John Patty. And I'm Warren Schlody. We'll be your hosts for this event, where media students are reminded that they are much less fit than kinesiology students. Right you are, Warren. It looks like things are getting underway with a classic game of The Floor is Hot Lava. And this event is being run by Alice from the Justice Studies program. Very good form by the athletes here. I'll say. I haven't seen someone jump around the point like that since I was trying to write my last essay. <laughs> That's me with every essay. Now let's head over to the other side of the gym, where two teams are fighting over the last piece of spaghetti. That's one thick noodle, Warren. <laughs> yes, indeed, John. I'd be very impressed if either team was able to pull this off. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Oh, okay, okay, hang on a minute. This is exactly what's wrong with the social media generation. You see, she's more focused on her Instagram feed than the game itself. It's sad because she isn't even experiencing the event, and especially where she is, is a dangerous place to be if you're not paying it. Whoa! Whoa, hold on a second here. Can we rewind that? Okay, look here, you see. Okay, here's the ball. You see it arcing in, and boom goes the dynamite. That will certainly leave a bruise. Maybe not physically, but certainly emotionally. Hey, you know what's really bothering me about this game? Everybody's throwing the balls at each other, but I haven't seen a single person go for the basket yet. You're right. In all my years of playing basketball, I don't think I've ever seen a low-scoring game like this one. Well, as you can see, we had a great turnout tonight, and there are a lot of interesting activities. And what's, wait, well, what's going on here? Well, it appears that our cameraman has spotted the pizza. <laughs> and he's making a break for it, too. I don't care who they say the winner is. This guy definitely has the fastest time across the gym, hands down. Well, we can say one thing for certain. This guy definitely has the most balls. Maybe not. And over here we have Corey doing his best impression of Mozart's hair. Well, yeah, but it looks like he's at the end of his rope. Oh, look at these guys getting in those gains. Huh, I tried to make a witty comment about that, but they're already lifting more than I can. Well, if you don't want to say anything, let's hear from our color commentary. Eva? Yellow! Thanks, Eva. And going back to the games for now, it looks like things are wrapping up, and we have ourselves a winner. Yes, the first ever GH Games champion is Ryan Gardner. Uh, John, he's wearing a Humber shirt. Like, he doesn't even go here. Well, I guess nobody checked the enrollment. Do you think we should just pick our own winner then? Uh, how about we let our camera guy decide? I like it. Oh, well, you heard it here, folks. The MVP of the GH Games is the Pizza Pizza Delivery Guy. <laughs> wow, what a fantastic event and such an unexpected twist there at the end. You know what, I think we'll all agree that these games were a smash success. That they were, Warren. But unfortunately, that's all the time we have here for today. We hope you enjoyed our coverage of the GH Games and hope to see you next time. If there uh, is a next time. I'm John Patty. And I'm Warren Schlody for Guhu Media, signing off. <laughs>